a scope half the size of a pencil is helping orthopedic surgeons treat patients without putting them to sleep. They can diagnose problems and sometimes operate without incisions. Health specialist Kathy Walsh reports that in some cases, procedures can be done right in the doctor's office. Megan McKenna is getting around on crutches six weeks after surgery. She had cadaver bone and cartilage transplanted into her left knee to fix a problem that had bothered her for nearly a year. Stabbing knee pain, especially when I would go upstairs, my left knee would buckle. Megan consulted orthopedic surgeon Dr. Rachel Frank at UC Health. Essentially what Megan has is a cartilage defect with bone bruising. In order to know for sure, Dr. Frank would need to scope the knee. I didn't want to do anesthesia if I didn't need it. So Megan was offered something new, a nanoscope. It's quite a simple procedure. The nanoscope is minimally invasive technology, half the size of a traditional arthroscope. With Megan awake, Dr. Frank injected a numbing solution in Megan's knee. Without making an incision, the tiny camera was inserted. Both could see the problem on a monitor. It kind of looked like a boiled egg when you peel the shell off poorly. It's as good as if I'm in the operating room looking at it with a formal arthroscopy. Megan walked out of the office with a firm diagnosis and two band-aids. I was back up mowing my lawn two days later. And she had the bone and cartilage transplant less than four weeks later. Dr. Frank is the first in Colorado to use the nanoscope. She started a study to see just how effective it is compared with a traditional scope. In Englewood, I'm Kathy Walsh covering Colorado First.